The power now back on for dozens of homes in Syracuse tonight. Their lights went out around 1 o'clock this afternoon when several power poles snapped. Fox 13's John Franke is in Syracuse with a look at the strange circumstance that caused the outage. The COVID-19 pandemic has many people working from home, relying on functioning power and internet to get their jobs done. Power's been on, internet's been fine, uh, and literally I'm on the phone to my boss and everything goes black. Monica Cook's workday came to a sudden stop Monday afternoon. Everyone heard a loud snap right when the power went off and so of course that caught our attention. At first Monica thought the wind caused the mess. When she went outside she discovered an unlikely cause of the disturbance. There was a dump truck apparently um, that rode down and didn't realize that his bed had gone up and he caught that wire and then he came down and he got that one and that one and then those three poles snapped in half. That truck took out several of those power poles. Rocky Mountain Power was out here for hours getting those repaired. Now it's the cable company restoring internet and TV service. This affected about 72 homes. The driver of that truck obviously shaken up. Well, the guy's walking around. He's looking pretty bad and I'm feeling badly for him. And so I said, hey, can I get you something? And he, he said, yeah, I could show you some water. So I had my husband go back and get him some snacks and a bottle of water. The cost to fix everything is estimated in the thousands. No injuries were reported. Neighbors here took the inconvenience in stride and made the most of the chance to take an unexpected break from work. Happy with the response. We were joking about having a cookout out here and just taking our grills and having some fun with all the meat we thought was going to go bad in the fridge. In Syracuse, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah. Fox 13 did reach out to Syracuse police about if any charges will be filed, but we have not yet heard back.